Welcome. In this video, I'm going to be taking a look at this NEU USB-C cable pack. So this was provided to me by the distributor, but they're not compensating me for this video and they're not reviewing it before I post it. If you find this video helpful, I'll put a link to this in the description on Amazon. And if you use that link, it helps me out a little bit and doesn't cost you anything extra. So this supports 3.1 amp fast charging, has LED indicator. So that's on the USB-C end here. The model number is DID4C, and this is a five pack. So we have the quick charge, flexible taper joints, tangle free cord, braided fabric coat. It's compatible with QC3. It says premium nylon braided coat and flexible taper joints. One stop cable solution, so it comes with five. And here are the specs. So the lengths are 1.6 feet, then we have two at 3.3 feet and two at 6.6 .6 feet. And in metric, that's 0.5, one meter and two meter. The bend lifespan is over 35,000 times and the insert lifespan is over 10,000 times. And here's a little diagram with the counts. We have a warranty card here, a welcome guide. So this is a good way to get a lot of cables in one go. Like many things, buying in bulk can save you money. So here's the shortest one here, and it comes with these little cable ties. They're rubber. And they are captive, so they're held on there when you're not using them. And then to use them, you feed the rubber through and just pull, and it locks in place. So these are braided nylon. So you have a wire on the inside and on the outside, it's almost like a rope sheath around it. So it makes it very strong, like pulling on it. It also makes it more abrasion resistant. So essentially take the properties of wire and rope and put them together. Near the USB-A end, we have the strain relief. So it's quite wide. So it's not a little wimpy strain relief. The logo here feels like it's laser etched on there, so it shouldn't rub off. And that's handy so you can know which way to put it in. Usually you'll have the label end up. Let's look at the USB-C end. It also has the laser etching there. Of course, this one doesn't matter which direction you put it. And we have the strain relief. So for the example of using this to charge a phone, typically I would use the shorter cable if I had a battery pack and I was carrying it with me say in my backpack or something, I could plug this into the battery pack, this into the phone, and charge the phone easily without having a long cable. And then next you have the one meter cables. And I'm just giving ideas on how I would use cables of these sizes. So on a one meter cable like this, typically I would use that on a desktop. So I might plug this in my computer, and I might plug this in my phone, and I would be using it at my desk. I'm not going to need a lot of room to move around. So the two meter cable here, I would typically use that, like an example would be on a nightstand. So I could plug this into, on mine I could actually plug that into the wall and then plug this into my device and then I could access it on my nightstand or if I'm in bed I could grab it and it gives me lots of room to maneuver. And my power adapter is down kind of closer to the floor so I have a couple feet up to my nightstand and this gives me a little extra length on top of that. So this came with five cables. So I know some people like to have a cable and they'll carry it around with them and plug them into things, but I like to keep cables in my car. I like to keep cables at my nightstand, on my desk. I keep cables all over. Cables are pretty cheap, so it's just handy to have them around. So I'll plug these in to get some power. I'll just plug them all in. So this has a light here on the end, and that's mostly so you can see it in the dark. So if you have like a dark bedroom and you have this on your nightstand, it makes it more visible. So I'll turn off the lights so we can see what that looks like. So here you can see the light. It's not super bright, but you don't need it to be super bright. You just want it bright enough so you can see it. You don't want this like a flashlight. Uh, so if you have this sitting on your nightstand, it's not going to you know, project a big light on your wall or keep you awake. So I gave examples of using this with a phone, but I'm actually going to use these with other devices here. So one, I have a GoPro, we have a USB port on it. Plugs in real nice. Thermal camera. Nintendo Switch. Here's a mouse. And a keyboard. So I'll turn this on here and we can see it's charging until I hit that button. There we go. And this one here is flashing because it's charging. Here we can see this one's charging and the mouse and keyboard are charging. So that light on the end just indicates power. It's not going to flash when it's charging. Your device may still have an indicator, but the cable itself just tells you when it has power plugged into it. So that's the NEU USB Type-C five pack of charging cables. So this is a great pack to get if you want or need a lot of cables. And even if you don't need five cables, 
you could always share it with someone, you know, friend or family member and, you know, take what you want out of it and then maybe pass the others on because people will always appreciate free cables. But if you're like me, you can always find uses for these cables. I have so many devices to plug in and charge that the more cables I get, the better. <laughs> so that's all I'm going to cover in this video. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. If you like this video, please click like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate if you could do that. And thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye.